Hey, what's up everybody? Joshua Casper back at you with another Two Minute Tuesday. And today I'm gonna to show you how to get the side chain style pumping for any patch, any preset inside of VPS Avenger. It's very simple to do and it's gonna take us less than two minutes to do it. So first of all, this is VPS Avenger. Let's go ahead and just load a sound. I'm gonna go ahead and click right here, come to factory synth, just choose this Android noise. Okay, and there we go. So the next thing I wanna do is come down here to the step sequencer. And I just wanna take the step sequencer and click right here and you'll see that I've got like a line now. And this is essentially a, a visual routing tool. So I can go to anything that's lighting up right now and automate it via the step sequencer. So what I wanna do is just go ahead and drop it right on the amp one volume, boom. And if I play it right now, nothing's happening. But if I take this little arrow right here and pull up like this, and drop the volume all the way down. Boom, we've got essentially a trance gate now. And that's because the volume is starting at zero and opening all the way up when the step is all the way open. So what I wanna do is just go ahead and draw in something that looks like, you know, a side chain uh, style curve here. Let's see what this sounds like. All right, and it's pretty much it. So we're already, uh, right there, if I come up to 64th. Yeah, sweet. And we can also do something right here with the contour. And by pulling it down, we'll get a lot smoother of a motion there instead of steps, instead of the rigidness. And maybe, you know, sometimes you might want that style, but the contour will smooth it out if that's what we're looking for. And that's it, that's how to get it. And you can do that for any patch because you're just gonna be using the amplifier volume there. You don't have to worry about anything else, but of course you can do the same sort of thing to anything. So if I wanted to take the step sequencer and put it on the filter cutoff here, drop that filter cutoff down, and again, bring it up like this. Boom. We've done it. So that's how to get that sidechain pumping done. That was a question that was posed to me on a different video. If you have any other questions and you want them covered in a two minute Tuesday or just a normal video about any of the plugins available on pluginboutique.com, go ahead and drop them in the comments. I read all the comments here on YouTube. So if you got something to say, let me know and I'll try to sort things out for you. Anyway, I'm Joshua Casper here for Plugin Boutique. I hope you learned something and I'll see you in the next video.